Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On this day, May 2nd, 1964, Charles Eddie Moore and Henry D. were murdered by members of the KKK. Moore, a 20-year-old college student, and D., a 19-year-old mill worker, were hitchhiking in the small town of Meadville. Posing as a federal revenue agent, James Ford Seal and some other Klansmen ordered the two men to get in a car and drove them to the Homicheta National Forest. While Seal had a gun on the men and questioned them, other Klansmen beat them with whip-like beam poles and tree limbs until gashed and bloodied the men were clinging to life. Seal, his brother, and another Klansman stuffed Dee and Moore into the trunk of a car and drove them to Louisiana. There, the two men were tied to an engine block and thrown into an oxbow lake. The two men were still alive. In early July of 1964, their bodies were discovered, yet it would be 40 years before James Ford Seal would be convicted of their murder. Canadian filmmaker David Ridgen and Thomas Moore, Charles's brother, who embarked on a pursuit of justice to bring the killer to trial, their tireless efforts would bring an award-winning television documentary, Mississippi Cold Case. My name is Rudy Nugent. I'm a junior at Cathedral High School, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.